Welcome to UITM Clinical Skills Program. This is Clinical Station 9, Airway Management. In this video on airway management, you will learn how to perform airway opening maneuvers, as well as the correct method of performing bag and mask ventilation. Part A of this video will demonstrate methods of performing airway opening maneuvers. This is an important part of basic life support. The first method to open the airway is called the head tilt and chin lift maneuver. Ensure that there is no suspicion of neck or spinal injury before using this method. To open the airway, place one hand on the forehead and apply pressure to tilt the head back gently. Use the thumb and index finger of your other hand to lift the chin upwards. Make sure that you do not close the patient's mouth as you do this. In the infant, the head is placed in a neutral position. In a bigger child or an adult, the head should be placed in a sniffing position. If you suspect a neck or cervical spine injury, especially in trauma cases, use the jaw thrust maneuver to open the airway. To perform the jaw thrust, place both hands beside the head. Then, place two or three fingers under the angle of the mandible and lift the jaw upwards. Take care that you do not close the mouth. The jaw thrust maneuver allows you to open the airway without tilting the neck or causing more injury to the spine. After opening the airway, the patency of the airway should then be assessed by three methods, look, listen and feel. Look for chest and abdominal movement, listen for breath sounds and feel for any breath. This is best achieved by placing your face above the patient with your ear over the nose and mouth, with eyes looking along the line of the chest for up to 10 seconds. Part B of this video will show the correct technique of bag and mask ventilation. First, size the mask that you would want to use. Ensure that the mask covers both the nose and the mouth. The upper border should sit at the bridge of the nose and the lower border just below the lip without extending beyond the chin. Once you have sized the mask, attach the correct sized mask to the ambu bag. The bag should be connected to an oxygen supply of 15 liters per minute via the oxygen port. Check to see that the reservoir inflates after connecting to oxygen supply. Also check that the valve opens upon bagging the self-inflating ambu bag. Apply the mask to the face. Hold the mask in a C clamp. Place your thumb and index finger on top of the mask. The other three fingers should grip the jaw to perform a chin lift or thrust. Clamp your fingers together to ensure that the mask has a good seal over the face. Squeeze the ambu bag while ensuring a good seal with the mask. Look for chest movement. If the chest is not moving, consider adjusting the head extension or repositioning the mask. Ventilate at the rate of 20 breaths per minute or at a ratio of 2 breaths to 30 chest compressions. In this airway station, you have been shown airway opening maneuvers using both head tilt chin lift and jaw thrust maneuvers. You have also been shown the technique of performing bag and mask ventilation. To supplement your learning, please go to our CSL platform to download materials related to this station. You are also encouraged to view this video again in our CSL platform to help you with your practice sessions.